Yeremiahu, Jeremiah 29. Now these are the words of the Sefer that Yeremiah the prophet sent from Yerushalayim unto the remnant of the elders, which were carried away captives, and to the priests, and to the prophets, and to all the people whom Nebuchadnezzar had carried away captive from Yerushalayim to Babel. After that, Yahu the king, and the queen, and the eunuchs, the princes of Yehuda and Yerushalayim, and the carpenters, and the smiths, were departed from Yerushalayim. By the hand of el Asah, the son of Shaphan, the gemar Yahu, rather, and gemar Yahu, the son of kilki Yahu, whom sidki Yahu, king of Yehuda, sent unto Babel, to Nebuchadnezzar, king of Babel, saying, Thus says Yahuwah Sevaoth, the Elohai of Yashra'el, unto all that are carried away captives, whom I have caused to be carried away from Yerushalayim unto Babel. Build ye houses, and dwell in them, and plant gardens, and eat eth the fruit of them. Take ye women, and beget sons and daughters, and take women for your sons, and give eth your daughters to men, that they may bear sons and daughters, that ye may be increased there, and not diminished. And seek eth the peace of the city, whither I have caused you to be carried away captives, and pray unto El Yahuwah for it. For in the peace thereof shall ye have peace. For thus says Yahuwah Sevaoth, the Elohai of Yashara'el, Let not your prophets and your diviners that be in the midst of you deceive you. Neither hearken to your dreams which ye cause to be dreamed. For they prophesy falsely unto you in my name. I have not sent them, says Yahuwah. For thus says Yahuwah, that after seventy years be accomplished at Babel, I will visit you, and performeth my good word toward you, in causing you to return to this place. For I know at the thoughts that I think toward you, says Yahuwah, thoughts of peace and not of evil, to give you an expected end. Then shall ye call upon me, and ye shall go and pray unto me, and I will hearken unto you. And ye shall seek me and find me, when ye shall search for me with all your heart. And I will be found of you, says Yahuwah, and I will turn away at your captivity, and I will gather you from all the nations, and from all the places whither I have driven you, says Yahuwah. And I will bring you again into the place whence I caused you to be carried away captive, because ye have said, Yahuwah has raised us up prophets in Babel. Know that thus says Yahuwah of the king that sits upon the throne of David and of all the people that dwell in this city and of your brethren that are not gone forth with you into captivity. Thus says Yahuwah Sevaoth, Behold, I will send upon them at the sword, at the famine, and at the pestilence, and will make them like vile figs that cannot be eaten. They are so evil. And I will persecute them with the sword, with the famine, and with the pestilence, and will deliver them to be removed to all the kingdoms of the earth, to be a curse, and an astonishment, and 
a hissing and a reproach among all the nations whither I have driven them, because they have not hearkened to my words, says Yahuwah, which I sent unto them, eth, by my servants, the prophets, rising up early and sending them. But ye would not hear, says Yahuwah. Hear ye therefore the word of Yahuwah, all ye of the captivity, whom I have sent from Yerushalayim to Babel. Thus says Yahuwah Sevaoth, the yellow high of Yashara'el, of Achav, the son of Kholayah, and of Sidkiyahu, the son of Maaseyahu, which prophesy a lie unto you in my name. Behold, I will deliver them into the hand of Nebuchadne Satsar, king of Babel, and he shall slay them before your eyes. And of them shall be taken up a curse by all the captivity of Yahudah, which are in Babel, saying, Yahuwah make you like Sidki Yahu, and like Achav, whom the king of Babel roasted in the fire because they have committed villainy in Yashara'el and have broken wedlock with their neighbor's women and have spoken at lying words in my name, which I have not commanded them. Even I know and am a witness, says Yahuwah. Thus shall you speak also, rather you also speak to Shimeyahu, the Nechel Alami, saying, Thus speaks Yahuwah, Sevaoth, the Elohai of Yashara'el, saying, Because you have sent Sepharim in your name unto all the people that are at Yerushalayim, and to Sephaniahu, the son of Maaseyahu, the priest, and to all the priests, saying, Yahuwah has made you priest in the stead of Yahuyada, the priest that ye should be officers in the house of Yahuwah. For every man that is mad and makes himself a prophet, that you should put him in prison and in the stocks. Now therefore, why have you not reproved Yermiyahu of Anathoth, which makes himself a prophet to you? For therefore he sent unto us in Babel, saying, this captivity is long. Build ye houses, and dwell in them, and plant gardens, and eat eth the fruit of them. And Sephaniahu the priest read eth this sefer in the ears of Yahu the prophet. Then came the word of Yahuwah unto el Yirmiyahu, saying, Send to all them of the captivity, saying, Thus says Yahuwah concerning Shema Yahu, the Nachel Ami, because that Shema Yahu has prophesied unto you, and I sent him not, and he caused you to trust in a lie. Therefore, thus says Yahuwah, Behold, I will punish Shema Yahu, the Nachel Ami, and his seed. He shall not have a man to dwell among this people. Neither shall he behold the good that I will do for my people, says Yahuwah. Because he has taught a rebellion against Yahuwah. 